It's Bonnie. Happy Thursday. I've got a couple fun videos for you guys today, including brand new Goose Creek products. Check it out. Goose Creek now has a foaming hand soap and a soothing body lotion. And a lot of people have been asking me about these, so I wanted to pick up a few so that I could review them. So I'm going to start with the body lotion first. It says our delicate Dry Touch Creamy Body Lotion visibly restores dry chapped skin with superior hydration. Um, for those of you who are, are kind of new to Goose Creek, I've been kind of reviewing Goose Creek candles. Um, I get the seasonal ones. I do like them. Um, I'll put the link below. It's GooseCreekCandle.com. But they just released, like I said, these new... Um, hand lotion. So I wanted to try them out. My only hesitation in getting too many was that like I'm already like, you know, I'm a Bath and Body Works girl. How do I open these? Okay, so they open on the top here. Check it out. A little bit different opening. Um, they are made in Italy and they looked pretty high end. So they are regularly $13.99 on sale for $9.99. I think I paid less though. When they um, just introduced these, I want to pay, say I paid like $6.99. They are a vitamin E, vitamin B5, almond oil, vegetable glycerin formula, and check it out, they are ultra clean, health conscious ingredients. They are cruelty free, vegan, non-GMO, and dermatology, um, dermatological. <laughs> That's the word, tested. Um, so I know a lot of you like these really clean products. So I thought I would try this. Like I said, they, um, no animal ingredients. So they seem to be like a really green product. So let's try some of this out. I'm not sure I like the, the lid. This is kind of an odd opening here. But let me test this one out. This one is called Marshmallow Waffle Cone. Oh my gosh, you guys. Holy cow. This does smell amazing. <laughs> it is a thinner formula. I would say it's probably similar to the Bath & Body Works Body Lotion. Um, in consistency, it's not that heavy cream. But they smell really good. Holy cow. So this is Marshmallow Waffle Cone. They also have this um, formula in cotton candy, soothing coconut, lavender vanilla, marshmallow waffle cone, which I have, um... Optimistic Vibes, Lush Getaway, uh, Tropical Daydream, Burlwood and Oak, um, Watermelon Lemonade, Watermelon Lemonade, holy cow, they have Watermelon Lemonade, and Macintosh Apple. I have a few of the other scents in the hand lotion that I, I mean, the hand, the foaming hand wash that I'll show you in a minute. But the notes on the, um, Marshmallow are, what are the notes? Um, Fluffy marshmallow, warm vanilla bean, vanilla sugar, warm butter, and vanilla dipped waffle cone. So you can smell um, the vanilla. It's these, these lids are just odd to me. This is like a really weird, I don't know, it's like an odd way to open this. I definitely smell the cone and the vanilla, and it's sweet. So if you like a waffle cone with vanilla, I think you're going to really like this one. So next up, we have the, I got four of these, actually. Like, I need more soap, you guys. <laughs> That's that's the joke. Like, I think I'm probably going to gift a few of these. I'm going to use these for, like, um, Mother's Day gifts. We'll see if I like them. I don't know. You know me. I'm a Bath & Body Works girl for hand soap. But I don't know. I'm fascinated by these. So look at the packaging. They're really cute. These have organic olive oil, organic aloe vera, organic argan oil, vegetable glycerin, vitamin E, vitamin B5, sorbitol, and lactic acid. Um, it's a lush, foaming, delicately fragranced hand soap, gently yet effectively cleanses hands while drenching skin with a decadent hydration. Again, cruelty-free, vegan, non-GMO, dermatologically tested. So if you're someone who has, like, problems with some of the harsher soaps, um, you know, maybe, maybe this would be a fun thing to try. So the first one I have is Cotton Candy. Let me see what this smells like. Oh, wow, that does smell like cotton candy. Holy cow. I'm just going to, um, so I'm going to figure out how to open these. So there's a clip on here. You pull the clip off, and then you have to put this in the right position. Oh, wow. So this is pretty, like, stand-up foamy. Um, it, it's more of a pretty, pretty 
foamy foam going on there, as opposed to, like, foam that just kind of dissipates quickly. Oh, wow, this one smells really good. We don't have a index here. <laughs> there we go. Um, I don't know if they use, like, dyes in here or what. I can't imagine how they got this blue without using... I don't think they're dye-free, because I can't imagine they could get this blue color. Um... But these are also made in Italy. So cotton candy is, let's see, cotton candy, cotton candy, cotton candy. Um, the notes in this one are, it says, yeah, made in Italy with the most premium ingredients on the market. Cotton candy, do they have the notes for these? It's funny, they don't have the notes on these, I don't think. But anyway, it smells like candy. This is definitely, oh, the notes are on the back, you guys. Look at that. That's funny. Um, I didn't even have to go to the website. Good good job, Goose Creek. Um, cotton candy, sweet sponge sugar, blue raspberry, and strawberry. So that's kind of cool. <coughs> Next up, I got the marshmallow vanilla waffle cone, which, you know, I loved this in the hand lotion just now. Oh, wow, that does smell really good, you guys. This smells like summer. Um, and fluffy marshmallow warm vanilla bean dipped waffle cone. These are nice. I'll have to say the soaps actually. Maybe the lotion was the lotions are nine ninety nine currently. The hand soaps are only four ninety nine, so not a bad deal. Um, I did get lavender vanilla. You know, I love the lavender vanilla scents. This one is fresh lavender, violet, rose, jasmine, amber, cedarwood, and warm vanilla. So a lot of um, like florals in this one. I don't know if I'm gonna like this one. Oh yeah, this is definitely. This smells like lush actually. I I, I actually kind of like this scent. Um, it's a little floral, but the lavender kind of um, tones it down. This one's really pretty, though. Look at this one. Um, and then the final one I got was Macintosh Apple. This kind of reminds me of fall. This one is the Juicy Macintosh Apple, Green Leaves, Apple Peels, and Soft Woods. I know I'm going to, like, get fall from this one. Oh, yeah, you guys. Smells like fall. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not ready for fall yet, you guys. I need a couple months. So, anyway... Um, I don't know. I'm, I'm kind of impressed with these. Check them out. Look at this. Cute bottle, made in Italy, premium ingredients, vegan, non-GMO, gentle formula. Um, they also come in tropical daydream, optimistic vibes, soothing coconut, watermelon lemonade, um, and that burl, burl wood <laughs> and oak. <laughs> That's kind of a men's scent, I'm assuming. But, um, it says, I don't know if it's everything, but it says, Goose, oh, the large candles like Goose Creek are currently buy two, get three free. Um, but I, I like Goose Creek. I like their candles, and I'm kind of impressed that they came out with, like, a new line. Let me know what you guys think of any of these, if you've tried them. Um, I'll certainly give them a try. The bottles look really kind of high-end. They have, like, the Goose Creek label on the side. I like the shape. It's kind of nice to be able to have that, like, hourglass shape to grab. And then, um, like I said, the, the soaps are really, really pretty, you guys. Look at these. And these are, how many ounces are these? These are a 9.1 ounce. Let's be up in Body Works, just out of curiosity. These are 8.7. So you're getting a little bit more product in here. And like I said, so um, price comparison with Bath & Body Works. So right now, Bath & Body Works is doing 6 for 26, I think. And we would get 6 for 30 on here, because these are like $5 each. So a little bit, you know, more uh, expensive, but you're getting the um, a little bit more product in these. So anyway, I don't know. I'm going to test them all out. Might gift a few. I'm excited um, to try these, though. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys later. Bye-bye.